Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. My name is Mark and today we're going to be opening some more Pokemon trading card game products. In front of me I have the Series 2 Kanto Mini Tins with each tin costing about $9 at my local Target. So that's a total of 45 bucks around for all five variants. As you can see when you line them up they make an image that, um, they, that connects together. And each tin actually comes with a picture card that um, you know is a paper version of what you see on the cover and you can line those up to also make the whole poster image. I've noticed that the Mew and the Charizard are probably the most popular design so if you're a little late to it it might be hard to find those if you're looking to collect the whole set but if you're not um, this should be pretty easy to get compared to something like Hidden Fates. So definitely check your local targets and see if they have them in stock if you're interested. Before we jump into the tins, I want to say that if you stick around to the end of the video, I'm going to be announcing a giveaway that's going to end late October. I'm giving away a free card um, and some other stuff, so definitely stay tuned for that and see how you can enter. It's really easy, and I'll just be pretty much mailing away free stuff. Cool. So without further ado, let's see what we get inside these mini tins. Why don't we start with, um, let's start with Mewtwo in the middle. So if you've never opened these mini tins, they're pretty straightforward. They cost nine bucks, so not as much as, you know, like these full on Hidden Fates tins um, that have four packs and a promo. These only have two packs inside and a coin and then that poster card that I mentioned um, that you can put together to make uh, the full image of all five tins. Also, if you like this channel or if you just like Pokemon content and want to see more openings, please subscribe to this channel as well as hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Um, let's start with the Mewtwo tin. And these are pretty well made. They have a nice little easy open pull tab. If you're curious about what the back looks like, there it is. So let's pop Mewtwo open. And the first thing we see is a random coin usually the kinds that you find in the three pack blisters. So we have the Alolan Ninetales. And then of course we have the Mewtwo card, which matches the artwork on the tin. I wish these were packaged more nicely because the corners get kind of bent because the edges are rounded on the tin, but you can kind of straighten them out. And yep, they did the same thing with the series one where the back has information about the Pokemon, which is kind of cool. It also tells you which slot to put it in if you collect all five. So we have the card, and let's see what kind of packs we get. I actually don't know which sets they include. Usually overstock or reprint type packs. And it looks like that's the case here. We got Sun and Moon, Crimson Invasion, and X and Y Ancient Origins. Wow. X and Y is old school. Let's start with that one. Uh, that's kind of expected for these kind of products. The Pokemon company just kind of packs old uh, boosters into it and sells them. But, you know, there's still some really cool cards in uh, these sets. So let's see what we get. We got Wooper, Golurk, Larvesta, Ralts. We got a Ball Toy. We got about these kind of full art looking ones. Our reverse hollow is an Inke, and our rare is a non hollow Metagross. Very cool artwork. I forgot what these cards are called, where it's like almost a full art. Um, there's a name to them Forest of Giant Plants, Blossom, and Ace Trainer supporter card. As always, I'll be doing a recap at the end of the video to show you the hits that we get. Doesn't count um, non-holographics, but um, it'll count the other types of hollows that we get. Okay, second pack. Weedle. Shellos. Bunnelby. Cacnea. Swinub. Our reverse hollow is a Bunnelby, the same one that we got earlier, I believe. And our rare is looking good. Nice, we got a Guzzlord GX, Ultra Beast. 
It's a nice card. That Glutton GX move is really expensive. Five Darkness Energy. But yeah, if you think about it, for a mini tin that has two packs, getting a GX is pretty awesome. So I'll set that aside. Water Energy, Counter Energy, Fighting Memory, and Counter Catcher. Why don't we continue with the Dragonite tin right here? Let's see what we get inside. Pretty difficult to open because they're shrink wrapped really well. I'm always indecisive about buying these mini tins because nine bucks is, you know, it's still kind of expensive, especially for old packs. But I actually just really like the design uh, of the tins. The artwork's nice, and I don't know if you can tell, but it's three dimensional, so it's kind of embossed, which makes it even cooler. Okay, so here's the Dragonite. Pop that open. Our coin is another Alola Ninetales. Big surprise there. We have the Dragonite poster card with Dragonite's information on the back. And then we have our two packs, which look like they are the same. Yep, Crimson Invasion and X and Y Ancient Origins. So we'll be seeing those two sets today. Let's start with the Ancient Origins again. We got Unknown, Beldum, Gumi, Inke, Baltoy, our reverse is a rare Metagross. Nice looking card. And our rare for the pack is... Cool, I love Entei, one of my favorite Pokemon. A non-holographic rare Entei card. Ace Trainer, Gloom, and a Paint Roller Trainer card. Okay. Let's move on to the Sun and Moon Crimson Invasion. I haven't opened these packs, or these booster sets in a while. It's like a throwback. Corfish, Shellos, Dano, Alolan Geodude, Staryu. Our reverse rare is a, or sorry, reverse hollow is a rare Staraptor. And our rare for the pack is a non-holographic Wigglytuff. So we got lucky with the reverse hollows there, but no GX cards or EX cards. And Grub Pig. Cool. Let's put Mew and Charizard in the center for last. Let's do the um, let's do the Vulpix and Pikachu tin next. I do wonder if these will become a regular product. Seems like they're popular enough to make multiple sets of these mini tins, so maybe they'll move on to different regions for the future tins because uh, they stuck with Kanto for the first two sets, which is totally fine with me because you know, Kanto is the classic. Just the poster card. Matches the tin's artwork. And the fun facts. Once again, in a Lowland Nine Tails coin, you can pretty much guarantee that um, that's the coin you'll be getting when you buy one of these. So, our two packs. Starting strong with the Magikarp, Golette, Larvesta, 
Malamar, it's a common, it's weird. Combi, our reverse hollow is a Persian, which is a common. And our rare for the pack is a Metagross, non-holographic. I think we got this as a reverse hollow in the last mini tin. Forest of Giant Plants, Ariados, and Lucky Helmet. Next pack, Crimson Invasion. Got Nummel, Minchino, Mistrevis, Alolan Geodude. Oops, sorry about that skip. Got a Pikachu. Our reverse hollow is a common corefish. And our rare for the pack is a non holographic Altaria. Psychic Energy, Counter Energy, Pillow Swine, Diggers B. So, so far we only have pulled basically one holographic card, which is the Guzzlord GX, which is pretty cool, but I guess it's kind of hard to find uh, solid pulls in some of these. Maybe they only come with two packs. Mew is actually one of my favorite Pokemon, so I'm going to save Mew for last. Let's do Charizard next. I mean, look how cool that uh, artwork is. I think they did a really good job with the illustrations on these tins. Okay. Get that off. Here's a better look. The usual coin. We got our Charizard poster card. The facts on the back. And we have our packs. Really jammed in there. Let's start with the uh, Ancient Origins. Let's see if we get something good in the Charizard tin. Ralts, Magikarp, Meowth. Spinarak. We have a ball toy, one of those like kind of full art ones. A uh, our reverse hollow is an uncommon Sceptile Spirit Link, and our rare for the pack is ooh, we got an Ampharos EX. Man, this is an old set. They're EXs, they're not even GXs yet. Nice looking card. Don't believe I have this one. Porygon two. A Flash Energy, and a Blossom. Second pack. Carablast. Swablu. Pumpkaboo. Execute. Weedle. Skiddo. Oops, oh gosh, sorry. It's stuck to the back, happens a lot. But we got something cool coming up next. Our rare for the pack is a Nihiligo GX. I'm actually not sure if I pronounced that correctly because I've never said the name of this Pokemon before, but we got two GXs. Oh, sorry, we got one EX and one GX in the two packs. So we're two for two on this tin. Charizard just bringing all the luck the pulls but very nice card water energy chinchino haunter suelus cool we're on to our last 10 the mew one Let's see what we get here remember to stay tuned for the giveaway information right after I finish opening this mini tin. I'll explain how you enter. It's basically just three easy steps. And then you get a chance to win some free stuff. Here's a better look at the Mew. Oh, I totally forgot to uh, to give Psyduck a shout out. There's also a Psyduck here. Who 
was dizzy and confused. Okay, here we go. Same exact coin, I have five of those now, one for each tin. Here's the poster card. Information about the Pokemon. And the two packs. Once again, we'll start with the, uh, the X and Y Ancient Origins. Got super lucky with that last one, the Charizard mini tin. That yielded a super rare card for each pack. Pretty cool. Last pack, Cottony. Sorry, last tin. Uh, Eevee. Oddish. Ralts. Magikarp. Our reverse hollow is a Ralts, and our rare for the pack is a non-holographic clay doll. Tyranitar, Spirit Link, Amphora, Spirit Link, Sligu, and I think that's it. Yep. Okay, last pack for this video, and then we'll get into the details regarding the Pokemon card giveaway. Shellos, Remoraid, Mankey. I never knew how to pronounce this actually because I don't watch the anime anymore, but I guess it's Jengmo-o, probably. Carablast, a reverse hollow, is a type null. Very cool, it's a rare. And our rare for the last pack is, nice, a holographic rare Agron. Really cool art on this one. Can't really see in the video that it's hollow, but it is subtly reflective there. Darkness Energy, Fighting Memory, Diggers B, and Mawile. So really quick, we'll do our recap. So in the five mini tins, which yielded 10 packs, we got a holographic Agron, a Nihiligo GX, probably butchering that name, the Ampharos EX, a Guzzlord GX, and that's it. So not bad for these old school packs. Okay, so let me explain the giveaway to you guys. Basically, I'm giving away a Gyarados GX and a Raichu GX, which are both promos from these Hidden Fates tins that I opened in my other video, as well as a Mewtwo pin or a Mew pin. And these are each from the Hidden Fates pin collection. So these are Hidden Fates things, which is a really popular set because of the awesome cards that are in it. But basically how you enter is doing these three things. Please like this video. Please subscribe to this channel. And last but not least, in the comments below, please state your favorite Pokemon. We're up to like, I think 800 Pokemon now. Back in my day, we had like, you know, a couple hundred, but now we have so many. So just tell me your favorite Pokemon. I'd love to know uh, which ones you're a fan of. And by doing those three things, liking this video, subscribing, and commenting below your favorite Pokemon, you will be entered in to win one of these promo cards, and I'll also send a winner, um, or each winner, a pin. So you have a chance to, for example, win a Raichu GX promo, and a Mew pin, or a Gyarados GX promo, and a Mewtwo pin. Uh, it's free stuff, so it's really a low investment to enter. If you're not interested in winning these, that's totally fine too. But if you are, please do those three things. And um, I'll personally message the winner uh, on the last day of October. So Halloween, October 31st. And then I'll message you so I can send you these cards and these pins right away. So once again, recap, like this video, subscribe to this channel, and comment below your favorite Pokemon ever. And if you win, I'll choose at random on August, oh, sorry, on October 31st. I will be sending you one of these promo cards and also one of the pins. Cool, so there'll be two winners, one set each. And um, yeah, good luck. 
Thanks so much for watching this video today. I hope you enjoyed it. My name is Mark. Until the next opening, take care and peace out. Bye-bye.